Hello YouTubers, welcome to my bedside. Today I am giving you an update from my bed here in my new pink leopard print uh, nighty and uh, it's getting cold. Winter is coming fast and furious. We were supposed to get snow today then luckily it was only sleet for an hour at night and then it switched to rain and rain is definitely better than snow so keeping the fingers crossed that the snow will still stay away for at least yeah four weeks that would be awesome so anyway it's getting cold and um so i decided well uh it's time to start buying a few more 90s and stuff and uh so I can snuggle in warm. So here we go. Ta-da! That's really nice pink leopard print. I really like it. So I thought I'll show it to you also and see what you think about that. And let's see. So we are going to move on to the update. Um, so first of all, I do desperately have to get my hair done. So I went ahead and bought the... Uh, red uh, color hair color so i'm gonna be doing that probably tomorrow and for those of you that ask this is the r57 cherry crush it's supposed to be a lot nice brilliant red which it does when you go out in the light sunlight it really makes it really look bright red and i love that so so that's a project for tomorrow probably and then uh, you will probably see me in the next video with the nice bright red hair or maybe not. I might be doing a few other videos first um, and I might then wear some wigs and stuff so kind of mix it up. Anyways, um, as most of you know that have seen the community page, I sometimes post things on the community page. so. If you uh, haven't seen it, check out my community page. I always post pictures of stuff, models and uh, truck models, car, uh, cars, um, tractors and stuff. Uh, I post occasionally some pictures of new stuff that I've got for my farms. And then also I post sometimes updates and pictures on what's going on in my life. And I just recently up loaded a few pictures of me being in the hospital get my infusion done i'm so happy i finally got it done and uh, it was three weeks overdue but we got it done and it went really really smooth um because it was so long overdue i did start getting several problems again symptoms were getting a lot more intense and I was really, really now happy that this week I got the infusion, or this last week, I got the infusion done. And uh, then it took me now several days to recover from that infusion again. And I actually had two days after the infusion a really, really, really bad fall. I thought when I went down I had busted a whole bunch of bones and stuff it was so bad uh probably the worst fall i ever had and uh banged up and bruised a few things here and there but i was able to manage and get back up and limp away <laughs> so whew, close call there but now i'm doing actually after over a week uh after the infusion now, I'm actually starting to feel a lot, lot better and getting stronger again. So I'm really, really happy that I got the infusion now. So I would like to, for anybody that's watching that has MS, multiple sclerosis, and you don't know what medication you want to get on, I have been on uh, Rabif, I have been on Copaxone injection, I have been on the Jelenia pill and then I went on to the Acrevis infusion. So 
That is the best thing ever to happen. Uh, was to get on the Acrevis infusion every six months, twice a year. You get your infusion and then you're good to go. And uh, it uh, destroys the B cells in your immune system. And they found out that the B cells are responsible for triggering the T cells to attack the central nervous system and the brain. So by blocking the B cells and uh, wiping them out, you then have a slowdown in progression. And um, that is a really great thing for people with primary progressive MS and even relapsing remitting MS. People might even have uh, things that they will be able to recover again if they relapse and permitting MS. So uh, I'm in the primary progressive MS. So for me, it's been the last three years a slowdown. And also I did come back a little again, thanks to some other medications that I'm taking. Um, I've been able to improve my walking for an hour or two. I can every day actually walk around and switch around and do stuff so that I can then on good days make videos for you. And um, yeah, so Ocrevis has been a total blessing. I totally recommend it for anybody with relapse and remitting MS and primary progressive MS. If you have secondary progressive MS, they have now the Siponi mod coming out from Novartis. Uh, almost any every country now uh, here in the US, I think Canada, and then also in Europe and in Australia now, they are starting to introduce that. And that's supposed to be a pretty good medication as well. So just wanted to recommend that. Um, so what else is new? Well, I'm going to be making a video about 164 scale police vehicles I bought for my 1 to 64 farm that I wanted to build, a big display. I bought a sheriff, a unmarked vehicle, a, a police vehicle, and they're all limited editions. Um, and I have, uh, I have one CHP uh, Bronco. And then I will also make another video about pickup trucks, all limited editions in scale 1 to 64. And uh, they will go onto my farm there as well. And uh, it's gonna be really awesome to have all kinds of different high detailed trucks and vehicles that I can add onto the 1 to 64 farm because it's not all just about farming, but the farmer, of course, needs a vehicle, a truck, his wife needs a vehicle to take the kids to school or whatever, or needs to go shopping. So that's already two vehicles. And then if you have a farm hand that will come over, they might have an older pickup truck or something, or also a new pickup truck. So that's already three vehicles. And then it's always nice to kind of bring into the scene maybe like a police car driving by, or the sheriff is just driving by. And it gives it a really nice touch when I eventually in the future make videos of my farm display once it's... Uh, it's all come together so so there's gonna be those two videos coming up and also Halloween is coming closer every single day because time literally is flying by and I bought a new costume for this year Halloween and it's gonna be a big surprise for all of you and uh, yeah so stay tuned also for that on Halloween uh, a new outfit uh, let's see, I was uh, in uniform one year, I was a police girl one year, I was Alice in Wonderland. And so this year I'm going to be something completely different. So definitely stay tuned for that also. So there's going to be a lot of videos coming down the pipeline here pretty quick. Uh, so yeah, if you're not subscribed, subscribe please, click, hit the notification bell. And also, 
please smash that thumbs up on today's video and leave a nice comment down below in the comment section if you like and then I will be more than happy to respond to your comment. With that said, thank you for watching. Hugs, love and kisses to all of you. And uh, like I said, stay tuned for a lot of videos to come very soon. Toodles! Mwah.